We're gonna come for having number two. I'm hoping this is my last sad video from the night. It came from the Daily Mail. Missouri man, 27, walks into a police station covered in blood and admits to murdering his girlfriend, 33, and her teenage boy and two separate Thanksgiving shootings. Damn. So this is the douchebag that did it. This is one of the kids. This is the woman. That must be the place. I guess that's the same building. So let me read this report and voice my opinion on this dick. Uh, Tori Andre Upchurch, 27. So let's, let's begin. Tory Upchurch walked into a Jefferson City Police Department just hours after Earl Key Jr., 17, and 33-year-old Shante Hill Cook were shot dead. Covered in blood, he allegedly told an officer in the lobby, I know I committed two murders before he was arrested and charged. First shooting occurred around 6 p.m. when Upchurch reportedly knocked down the door at 1308 McCarthy something or another, where Key had been staying. Upchurch dressed in dark clothing and said he said that um, having shot the teenager in the face with a 9mm handgun as he opened the door, killing him instantly. Oh, God. Less than three hours later, a second shooting was reported five miles away. Police arrived. At the Shantae Hill, Cook did, sorry, in the street, and multiple gunshot wounds in her car is missing. Cook Hill Upchurch was said to have been dating for a number of months. Oh my God, man. I'm sorry. Uh, I've had this happen to family members, so it, it gets a little bit emotional. Um... I kind of don't really want to finish reading this because I've had this happen to family members because some of the women in my family have made really stupid procreation choices. And, um, you know, uh, I've had some friends in high school that was murder-suicide. I had a guy who was like a big brother to me kill his girlfriend and his self in front of his baby, just like the guy in high school years before. And then I had two cousins die because of jealous men. Which my next video will also be about stuff like that. But anyway. You know. Kind of. It's times like that it, did you wish you just couldn't read. I mean you really. You just really wish you were illiterate and ignorant to the things of the world. But you can't be. Because if you're illiterate and ignorant to the things of the world. You will be the victim of the next slaying. I'm sorry that I can't really finish this video because it got me a little bit upset. So I'm going to make another video. It's going to hopefully be happier. Thank you guys very much.